everyone, this is Dave from Geekanoids, and this is the Feligan Power Brick. Now, I hadn't heard of the brand before being offered the Power Brick 2 review, so really excited to be able to bring you my evaluation of this product. It's quite a big, imposing charger, and the cable you can see just coming off the side here plugs into your mains power socket. And let me just give you a look around the back, pretty plain on the back, just some information there. And then on the base here, we've got some sort of feet, rubberized feet there, and also some ventilation there for any heat that might be generated. And then on the front, this is really interesting. This is something that sets this apart from regular chargers. We've got a couple of additional USB sockets. We've got an LED light to show there's power going to the unit. And then we've got two plug sockets here and you can actually plug additional devices in here to charge them or run them from the device but what's unique about these is that they have got uh, sort of cutouts for a UK plug a European plug or a US plug as well they give a 10 amp output and are very useful for plugging additional devices into the front now on the top, this is where the magic happens, and mine is configured with three 30-pin connectors for iOS devices, and then we've also got three micro USB connectors as well. I'll just give you a close-up look at one of those. And they pull out on the cables, like so. Quite a long cable. Here we go, we keep going. So as you can see, a very long cable. And then when you finish charging your device, you give it a pull and it retracts back into the unit. I think that is a very, very neat design. Now I've got a lot of iOS devices. I've got my iPhone 4 here. So let's put out one of these 30 pin dot connectors and plug it into the bottom. And there we go, it starts charging straight away. And of course, when I finish charging, just disconnect the dot connector, give it a little pull and it goes back into the unit. This is a very neat solution, and I think the fact that these wires retract and keep nice and tidy when not in use is a real good design feature. One of the things I think could be improved is when you're actually charging the device. Let me just demonstrate this. So let's suppose I've plugged this one in here, and I'm charging it. There's nowhere for me to sort of stand the device. I've just got to put it down on the desk or the table. It would have been nice if there'd been some sort of little platform up the top here, maybe a little bit bigger, maybe a rubberized section on the top here, so I could just lay my devices on here without the fear of them slipping off. That would be the icing on the cake, so a little bit bigger platform on the back. I mean, it's a big device anyway, so being a bit bigger isn't really gonna make it any less useful. I think it's gonna actually make it more useful having this platform at the back extended. Now, price-wise, I was really surprised with the pricing. If you shop around on this, 53 pounds in the UK, or around about 70, 71 dollars in the US. I think that is a fantastic price for a charger that can actually charge so many different devices. Don't forget we've got all of these, plus the USBs, plus the power sockets on the front as well. That is absolutely brilliant, and it comes in different colors as well. Now I'll be leaving a link underneath this video so you can check out Fedigan's website. Thank you very much for watching. Please do hit that like button. Please do subscribe, and I will see you all in the next video.